Hello, I'm here with Sirius, and today she's going to teach you the history of the world and how dogs and people became best friends. But first, we have to go back in time. Yes, go back in time, all the way back to the early primitive people and the early dogs. Back then, dogs and people weren't best friends, but it's not as though dogs just one day, you know, came and waved to low and to the early primitive people and were like, hey, let's be buddies. No, we are, we evolved together. First, dogs began to circle the campfires. Yes. Getting close to the light and to the smell of food. Circle. Yes. Good girl. And eventually, we started to work together. But first, Dogs were invited into the camps. They started to sleep near the people. Yes. And then primitive people started to invite dogs even closer and became willing to share a meal and cook together. Yes. Primitive people learned pretty quickly that dogs were pretty useful. They were able to do all kinds of things like assist in the hunts. Yes and bring in meat for everybody to eat. They're also able to help them gather things that they needed for early life together. Yes. Early life wasn't easy for dogs and people, but it became easier as they were able to work together. Pretty soon, as we work through history, Dogs and people were able to soon start evolving together, and dogs started to do specialized jobs. Some of those early jobs, dogs still do today. Dogs were able to assist with livestock. Moo, 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 moo. And help, yes, right. Yes, help farmers and ranchers corral their cattle and other forms of livestock. Then we were able to see other sorts of specialized dogs developing, like Newfoundlands, like Sirius, that could help people who were drowning. Help, 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 help! Go get it! Yes, bring! Sirius, bring! Yes. Thank you for saving somebody from drowning. Good job! Today, Dogs do all kinds of complicated jobs in our world. Yes. Yes, and we rely on dogs for all kinds of things. Good girl. And in fact, we know that has always been the case between dogs and humans because we can see the early cave paintings that still exist Yes, from early primitive people like we were learning about. They drew cave paintings depicting the kinds of relationships they had with dogs. Can you draw a cave painting? Oh, very nice. Good girl. Yes. As time has progressed on, dogs and people have continued to evolve our relationships together. Like how in 1884 the American Kennel Club was created. Pull. Look at how soon people started having dog shows. Can you, can, you have, can you pull the dog? Can you show how to show a dog? Great job. Well done. Yes. And now, as time has continued, yes, it's pretty sure that dogs are our very best friends. And the world kind of even revolves around them. Huh? Skit. Yes. Right. Yeah. And that is the history of dogs and humans. Can you think about